Hey, Gut Fox here. Today we have a review of 98 overall Willie Brown. This is his limited time card. You saw me pull it. Uh, very similar to his 97. This one's going for about 300k more, just about. Uh, well, 275. 95 speed. Make sure you get that pick specialist cam up to get that extra speed. Speed is so important in this game. 96 acceleration, 91 agility, 95 man, 94 zone. Press at 85, 96 play rec, 76 catch. So we'll talk about the press first since every other stat seems to be pretty great. Do you guys play a lot of two man under? Or do you guys play a lot of cover zero or cover one press? Now, I play a lot of cover two. Occasionally cover three and occasionally backed off man to switch it off. So I rotate through a lot of different plays like that. But again, like 80% of my defense is cover two. So he's going to be playing near the line of scrimmage. And like I said in the Kraus review, I like bangers and mash as my defense's identity. Mash in the middle to kind of slow down the running back. And then bangers on the outside to have the hit power. Block shed to get off to really uh, try and force some fumbles here. There's Brown pursuit. They're catching the running back down. But Brown's... I think the only issue I have with this card is his, uh, okay, there he was in man coverage. He kind of got separated, but then the other uh, Taylor, Sean Taylor got the pick on that, is his 81 hit power versus, like, say, like a 91, like a night train lane type hit power. So he's not the ideal banger, and he, he oftentimes, like, he doesn't make a ton of plays. It doesn't seem like he shows up in the field a lot. He's got good block shed, though, for a corner. Amazing stuff against the run. That's kind of what I uh, like to see a lot. Here he is, deep SWAT. He'll do that as good as anybody. He'll get that out of here. The, he'll matumble that thing. So a lot of a lot of greatness there. Um, bad play right there on his man. Like That's the thing. He's got that high man coverage, the 95 man coverage, but it's kind of broken this year no matter how, how it's uh, played, a except for like getting some quick pressure, cover one's pretty decent. But everything else... Um, not great. There he is, swatting it down again. So, I think he's an ideal corner for cover two, but like his other card I reviewed earlier this year, he just didn't show up on film a ton. And I don't know why that is, because he's got the stats for it, which is crazy. So, the fact that he wasn't, like, making big plays for me and, like, doing things like Kraus makes big plays, Barry makes big plays, uh, Night Train Lane makes a few big plays, but not nearly as much as, say, uh, Blunt. Blunt makes a lot more plays. So maybe it's the height that has to do something with this or the jumping. Um, there he's getting beat over the top. But that's like a cover two. So you can't really blame him for that one because he wasn't really um, – that wasn't really a zone. It's kind of past his zone. It's a, it's a good way of beating cover two there. Um, but there he is cutting off, seeing that uh, play rack, getting his tackle broken. So you never want to see your tackle broken when you want to be like cover one. But in the 72 block, should, like I said, 78 tackle, 82 hit power. Good, but not great. Like, better than Dion, but not, I mean, I'm not amazing, anything like that. Like, his traits will go through here. Clutch, yes. High motor, yes. Big hitter, no. Strips ball, yes, which is awesome. Gotta love the strip ball feature for the CPU. That stuff comes in handy a lot. Uh, you see that happen. Plays ball and air aggressive. So, generally, I, I think the guys that the play ball and air aggressive are the better playmakers. Um, as Brown picks it up, we cannot stumble towards the end zone. And that was an OT, though. It's a nice pickup round. Nice way to catch it off the ground. There he's getting cut block and taken out of the play. So his, his legs get chopped down as, as well as anybody's. Um, but I don't know. There he's missing another tackle, but I guess he's set up for the fumble. So uh, I don't know. Amazing stats, but invisible on the field. It's, it's the weirdest thing. Like I don't know why some cards constantly make plays over and over. There he was getting blocked, and then... Uh, disengaged and was not able to get so like the, the block shed isn't perfect so I don't have them taking on uh, Mike Ayupati or anything like that but overall I mean is it good that you don't really know it as a cornerback yeah it'd be great if he made plays constantly but you know I'm always pressing the swap button there he's just getting run over also don't have him take on any running backs it seems like geez whoo anyways there he is avoiding blockers to get there so pursuit angle strong Great, but is he worth 725k? If he's just gonna be a pretty good corner, you know, man coverage, his strengths kind of busted, but decent zone, decent block shed, oh, low end, you know, I, I I wouldn't say low end, but not great hit power, um, medium hitter, I guess I'd call him, not a, not a fantastic hitter, but he will get the strip animation. How many? I'm surprised I haven't had any Willie and penis jokes yet, so we're just gonna avoid that because I I guess I'll use that one. As my one for the whole review. I feel cheated though. I don't know. I should have done better there. I could have I could have been a contender. I could have had a Willie. So there. 
Um, here he is on the edge, and he does hold up the block there. Stopping him on the fourth down, the clutch play. He's got that clutch, yes. Can he knock it out? Oh, smacked. So, Willie Brown, solid, solid player. Is it worth 700? I guess it depends on your team. It depends on your scheme, too. I like this guy better in a cover, two than many of the other or any of the other type situations. <laughs> Can't believe the guy caught that. That was amazing. Um, because... He can hit, but he's, you know, not, not, like I said, not blunt, not light, light train lane, but you do need a third person. I guess Ramsey would be the best third person. They are just whiffing on that one. Man, I don't know. See, there's a lot of those questionable plays here, Brown. What can Brown do for you? Pick up a fumble. A couple of them. Nice work, dude. Um, but underneath the man route, nothing great. So, overall, 725K is a lot, but his set is a lot cheaper um, and should get cheaper with this weekend. But... I do like him. I don't love him. I think Jalen Ramsey, that card played similar to this Brown. Um, just a little bit slower, obviously, 95 versus 93 speed. But that's it. I guess out of 10, this guy gets an 8.8. .8. Thanks for watching. Call to action. I'll see you tomorrow.